ਸਟੈਪਿੰਗ ਸਟੋਨਸ ਪੀਐਸਐਲ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਰੀਡਰ 3A 2020 ਐਡੀਸ਼ਨ ਲੈਸਨ 7 ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਜੀ ਆਇਆ ਨੂੰ ਲੈਟਸ ਕੁਇਕਲੀ ਰਿਵਿਊ ਹੋੜਾ ਐਂਡ ਕਨੋੜਾ ਟੁਡੇ ਲੈਟ ਵੀ ਵਿਲ ਸੀ ਦ ਮੋਹਰਨੀ ਐਂਡ ਵੀ ਵਿਲ ਓਨਲੀ ਯੂਜ਼ ਦ ਮਾਤਰਾਸ ਐਂਡ ਸਿੰਬਲਸ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਰਿਵਿਊਡ ਸੋ ਫਾਰ ਸੋ ਰੀਡਿੰਗ ਸ਼ੁੱਡ ਬੀ ਈਜ਼ੀ ਫॉर ਯੂ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਲੈਟਸ ਟ੍ਰਾਈ ਇਟ ਸੋ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਗੋਇੰਗ ਟੂ ਰਿਪੀਟ ਆਫਟਰ ਮੀ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਮੋਰ ਯੂ ਸੇਟ ਮੋਰ ਯੂ ਰੀਡ ਬੈਟਰ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ ਬਿਕਮ ਇਨ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਓਕੇ ਓ ਆਓ ਸੋ ਸੋ ਹੋ ਹਾ ਕੋ 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 ਗੋ ਗੋ ਕੋ ਕੋ ਚੋ 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 ਜੋ ਜੋ ਚੋ ਚੋ ਟੋ 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 ਡੋ ਡੋ ਟੋ 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 ਦੋ ਦੋ ਤੋ ਤੋ ਨੋ ਨੋ ਪੋ 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 ਬੋ ਬੋ ਪੋ ਪੋ ਮੋ ਮੋ ਯੋ ਯੋ ro ro lo lo vo vo ro ro so sho sho ho ho zo zo fo fo we are missing go wo ga we hardly use that sound anyways which letters do not use hoda okay uda has hoda does ada have hoda no it doesn't so ada does ed have hoda ed is not even there so no ed ada and ed don't have hoda which letters do not use kanada does uda have kanada no it doesn't so uda ada has kanada how about ed ed is now have kanada so put ed here now look it's interesting right when uda has hoda on it it stays open when it's not closed it's open this means it has a hoda on it okay note we use a bindi to add a nasal sound in hoda and kanada words okay not tippy but bindi um except when we write uda ada together then we will write a tip here like an oankar oankar actually we add a tip here so you're right um, bindi is used only many punjabi words are made with only one letter and and hora or knora read these words and write one more word in the boxes you may write english words so here's ho ho means you are jo ever go means go do means to um do also means although kind of thing right no no is no to means wash bo is foul smell kushbo is good smell but bo is bad smell ro means cry ro also means a row of things right show so is 100 and how how right so what word other words can you write you can choose one some of these words right here okay so um now you can say n kanora now here if you want to right you you can write the same words here so you will um be smart and you will choose some words you will make some words and write them over here after we finish the lesson now here is a little bit a bit of reading it's a short passage kind of a short story 
with Hura Kannada words. Okay, let's find all these words um, after we read it. Oho, eki hoya, e sara khlara, kisne paya? Khlara means mess. Look at the mess here. Chalo sab ralke safai karo. Poli ethe ao. Sare khdone dabbe vich pao. Pole ao. Sariyan kitaba phatte te rakho. This is phatta. Babi ao. Sare kapde laundry vich lai jao. Look at the clothes. Farsh kaun saaf karega? Farsh mein saaf kar diyangi. Sara kamra sokha hi saaf ho jawega. So there are only 55 words in this passage. And if you are reading about 30, 35 words, it should take you less than two minutes to read it. Okay. So you will read this passage one more time. Then circle all the Hoda and Knoda words in them. Okay. All right. Next is your homework. No, you can do it in class if you have time. You will read and learn the Punjabi words. Copy these words in the table. So these are rhyming words, actually. Let's read like this. It says, coat, boat, note. Okay, and these are their meanings. Bowl, goal, toll. Rose, khoj, soj. Roti, Choti, Koti, Moti, Soti, Choti, Dori, Pori, Chori, Moti, Poti, Toti, Toti is a sheep parrot, Hathora, Kora, Sora. So learn these words, how to say them, how to write them, and their meanings. That's going to build vocabulary. Tuesday homework. Number words with Hura and Kanara. Learn to read these number words. Then copy them in the boxes. Do, no, chauda, sola, chauvi, chanti. On Wednesday, or you can do it on Tuesday, copy the passage from page 23 from the previous page that we read about the mess, right? Beautiful writing. That's going to help you become a better Punjabi reader and writer. Thursday homework. Start the timer. Read the passage from page 23. How long did you take to read it? How many minutes? Okay. And that is the lesson for today. Easy, right? So now you're becoming a better reader. You're becoming a better writer. And that is our goal. So I will see you in the next lesson very soon. Until then, keep on working hard and learn Punjabi. Vaheguru Ji ka khalsa, Vaheguru Ji ki fateh.